betting big on China as he seeks to rekindle ties to the Philippines' powerful Asian neighbor. And in doing so, Manila's hard-fought victory over China in an international arbitral court won't be brought up in any talks in Beijing. Willard Chang filed this report. The issue of the South China Sea dispute is off the table, so says Foreign Affairs Secretary Perfecto Yase Jr. on President Duterte's state visit to China. The purpose of this trip is not to discuss the Scarborough Show, the South China Sea dispute. The purpose of this trip is precisely to strengthen our relationship with China, especially so in the other aspects of this relationship, which is the main bulk of our relationship. Trade, investments, infrastructure development, cultural exchanges, people-to-people -people contact. Yes, I adds, neither will the issue of allowing Filipino fishermen access to Scarborough Shoal will be part of Mr. Duterte's China agenda. For the Chinese to allow our fishermen to fish in Scarborough Shoal is suggestive of the fact that they own the Scarborough Shoal, which is not something that we can accept as a premise at this point in time. We have our own procedures, we have our own constitutional mandates, we have our own limitations or constraints under constitutional and legal processes within the Philippines. Joint exploration activities with China and disputed waters are also not officially included in the agenda. This is not the time to talk about joint exploration. We are just simply talking about how we can improve better ties with China without eroding or compromising our disputes, which is just a small portion of our relationship with China as regards the South China Sea.